Hey, this is Brett. Hope everybody's having a great day out there today. And I am super excited to go over this ultra clean, extremely good looking 2021 Audi Q7 Premium 45 TFSI Quattro. This is stock number 24J346A. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used SUV headquarters. This 2021 Audi Q7 has the two liter turbocharged four cylinder engine. It puts out 248 horsepower, 273 foot pounds of torque. It's paired up with the eight speed automatic transmission. And of course, being a Quattro, it is all wheel drive. This vehicle has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. And this vehicle is 100% ready to go. This one has the convenience package as well as the 20 inch wheel package and it is a one owner clean title history clean carfax from right here in fond du lac wisconsin i'm going to go all the way around in this video inside start it up take a look under the hood show you all the options and give you the most accurate representation possible of the vehicle navara blue metallic is the color and uh, paint code is 2d 2d I shoot all my videos in 4K, and if you like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications, and get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube, and stay current on our ever-changing and vast SUV inventory so you do not miss out on gems like this one. The 20-inch wheel group was a $1,000 option in 2021, and uh, you can see you get the 20-inch painted silver alloy wheels. It has Yokohama Geolander XCV tires on here. These are 285 45 our 20s and they are brand new we put those on in our safety inspection you can still see the little knobs on those tires being brand new so four brand new tires on this vehicle front fender is in excellent condition i didn't see any dents or dings on there this one does have the led headlamps and led running lights i will show you those how nice and bright they are at the end of the video you get the front bumper parking sensors conveniently hidden in the bumper there and the front bumper itself is in fantastic condition. I didn't see any dents, dings, scuffs, or scrapes, or cracks. Get the Audi symbol there. This one does have the 360 camera on it. And the hood is in excellent condition. I didn't see any major dents or dings on there. Paint looks really nice. And the passenger side front fender is in excellent condition as well. Passenger side front wheel, no major scuffs or scrapes on there. And let's check out this Navara Blue Metallic. It's got a lot of metal flake in it. A lot of really fine metal flake. Might even be a pearl, considered a pearl. But you can see just how nice that paint is and how reflective and shiny and glossy it is. And as you go down this side of this 2021 Audi Q7, once again, take note of how nice that paint is and how clean the body is. No major dents or dings down that side. Looks really, really good. And coming around to the back, very nice and clean as well. I take these HD videos, so if you are far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the vehicle, hear the vehicle, and have confidence in what you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises. You can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video. It was helpful and that Brett sent you. Back wheel's in pretty nice shape as well. And these back tires are brand new too. I don't know if we can see much under here. A lot of it's covers and plastic and stuff. So not much to see under there. And coming around to the back of the vehicle, you get the LED tail lamps. They look so good when they're all lit up. And like I said, I'm gonna turn those on at the end of the video. You get the backup parking sensors. This one does have a towing package. You get a receiver hitch and seven pin wiring back here. And this rear gate is in really nice condition as well. This is a power lift gate. And that works nicely. Back storage area is very nice and clean. You do get storage under here as well. There's your tire inflator kit. And these seats do power fold down. You got the buttons right here. There's also buttons on the inside uh, behind the second row, which I'll show you in just a little bit. But you can see just how nice and flat that those go. And to get them back up, you just got to press and hold them. And that works really nicely. To get this gate down, you press this button right here. That comes down like so. 
Just a really, really nice vehicle, very well maintained. The uh, rear quarter is in excellent condition as well. And for full disclosure, this back wheel is absolutely perfect. Four wheel disc brakes on there. That tire is brand new as well. And uh, yeah, has a nice roof rack on it. And down the rest of the side of the vehicle, no dents, no dings. Does have the heated power mirrors, built in directional signals. Take a quick look at the back seats. You get the second row bench seating. There are no rips or tears on these seats. You get the latch child safety system. Smells very clean inside this vehicle. I don't think it's ever been smoked in. And these seats are adjustable. I think you gotta be almost sitting in them for it to work, but you can see they slide forward and back. You do get two USB-Cs back here, a 12 volt power point and a rear air control or rear temperature control, I think. All weather floor mats back here as well. These seats do fold down and you gotta press this up and pull it like so to get to the third row. And you can see they got the buttons right there to put those third row seats down. The third row seats are in fantastic condition as well. No rips or tears back there. Seats go down like so. And inside the doors, you get the, what did they say, brown grain, um, fine grain, wood grain trim. Uh, you get the child safety locks on the back doors and the inside and bottoms of the doors are all in really nice condition. Up front, the premium package gives you the same black leather bucket seats. No rips or tears on these seats. Both of these front seats are heated and I believe power. Power driver seat lumbar, all weather floor mats up here as well. You do get uh, your bright control, cruise controls right there. Power telescopic and tilt steering wheel, that works nicely. And power windows, locks, and mirrors, heated mirrors, power fold-in mirrors, uh, memory driver's seat, and the wood grain trim on there as well. We'll hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this one has to offer on the interior. So you can see those mirrors do power fold in. I always like showing both sides so you know that all the features and stuff are working properly on the vehicle you're looking at. You get the nice, uh, I would say it's about a 12 inch LCD display, uh, digital um, everything basically. And you can see this one, digital speedometer on the right, digital tack on the left, and this one has 41,047 miles on it. You get an outside temperature display as well. And the instrument cluster is very nice and clean. It does come with the leather wrapped steering wheel. You got Bluetooth and audio controls on the right information center controls on the left you have paddle shifters on there as well comes with the audi infotainment system there does have the factory navigation system there's highway 41 so that is working nicely you also get am fm and sirius xm radio capabilities on here you get your home screen uh, you also have all your different apps that you can do so you got phone apps, so Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, radio, all that good stuff. And then your cameras are on here too, somewhere. Just had them up. Might have to start the vehicle for that to uh, go. But anyways, a lot of cool stuff you can do with this radio. Down here are your more, are, are your climate controls, your heated seat buttons, uh, dual climate controls right there, your start stop, downhill assist control, um, your home link buttons. You can turn this screen or this top screen off actually. And uh, that just brings you more stuff down there. Stability control, uh, that's how you look at your cameras. There you go. So you can see you have your surround view camera up there. And then you get the front view, kind of a, a round view. The full surround there, the backup cam, the uh, kind of surround backup cam down the front wheels, down the back wheels, and, uh, and then of course the 3D model here. You can change the angles. It's kind of crazy how this works. 
you can see the picture studio and everything it's really neat um, so a lot of really cool stuff you can do with that uh, radio and screen there here's your shifter for the eight-speed automatic transmission keyless entry right here that's a nice shape and we got a little holder for it too cup holders there and uh, get the nice gloss black dash trim passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition as well and you get the huge vista roof and uh, power I believe it's a power sunroof too um, yeah and that opens up like so and you can see that's working nicely and that goes that far also has a power sunshade as well but uh, once again smells very clean inside this vehicle I don't think it's ever been smoked and you get the SOS buttons up there sunroof sunshade controls map lights and an auto dimming mirror with a, a compass display let's start it up and take a look under the hood and check out those LED lights in front starts right up no check engine lights or anything like that I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video first off hopefully you enjoyed it secondly more importantly I hope you were able to verify the quality condition options and of course cleanliness of this vehicle all the way around inside and out see those lights are very bright and working nicely under the hood we have the 2 liter turbocharged 4 cylinder engine. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. Once again 248 horsepower, 273 foot-pounds of torque. And once again this vehicle has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop. Has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. Four brand new tires. Shock is doing a nice job holding that hood up. There is the emissions sticker. And this Audi is 100% ready to go. I would highly recommend this vehicle from a quality and condition standpoint. I think it's probably one of the best looking SUVs on our lot. Just that Navara blue with the silver accents all the way around. Just a really good looking vehicle and ultra clean inside and out. And like I said, I'd highly recommend it. I'd ship this one anywhere, whoever's gonna get it. It's going to absolutely love it. And to see more pictures of this Audi or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got to go to the website right there, summitauto.com, full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. And if you want to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest uh, catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube. And stay current on our ever-changing and vast, ultra-clean SUV inventory so you do not miss out on gems like this one. In fact, in a second you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Audi Q7s I've ever done in the upper right, link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we are super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2021 Audi Q7 Premium 45 TFSI Quattro in Navara Blue metallic thank you so much for checking out the video i hope you enjoyed it remember to like subscribe and share on the youtube channel i'd really appreciate it thanks again and have a great day